what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel so super stoked you're here so I had an idea recently and so I had an idea recently and I wanted to test it out see I was scrolling through YouTube and I came across a video with over a million views on how to do a quality video on free YouTube for under a hundred dollars and I started thinking I set my entire studio up for about a hundred dollars so is that really a budget so I'm gonna make my next video which is my last video for you guys and I'm gonna see if I can do it for around $20 so here I am at five below with target behind me and I'm gonna see what I can do let's go Okay, that was actually a pretty good haul. I mean, I couldn't believe I got all that for $20. I got a light, I got a phone stand, and I got a microphone. <laughs> like, they had a $10 USB microphone. If that thing's any good, dude, I'm gonna be shook. All right, let's go back to the, let's go back home and see what we can make out of this. All right, so we're back home. We got a pretty good haul here. Let's check out everything we got. We have our smartphone stand. We have our USB microphone and we have our clip light. I'm not extremely hopeful about this microphone for a couple of reasons. The biggest one being, I didn't realize until I got back, this has been returned. So there's probably something wrong with it, but if it works, I'm going to be ecstatic. And I chose this over the selfie stick stand that I showed you because one of them was open at the store. I got a good look at it and Honestly, it was a really bad build quality and I didn't think it was gonna be worth it. So I have to charge up the light and I have to set everything up. Oh, I forgot to say, I also got this white foam board. I'm gonna show you guys what I did with that or what I'm gonna do with that in just a second, but let me go ahead and get everything set up and get started. Okay, so I got everything set up now. It's the, the light, I charged it up, the microphone I put together and the stand I put together. Let's go ahead and take a look at the stand. It's a pretty sturdy, it's plastic. So, I mean, it's $5. I wasn't expecting the greatest thing for $5, but it does look like it's pretty good. It's stable because it is that really, has this really nice heavy base. So I'm not too worried about it falling over or collapsing under the weight of the phone, which if you have, like me, I have an iPhone 12 Pro Max, so that's a pretty heavy weight. And you have to be careful of things like that. The light is really good. As you see, I got it right here on me. Charges up in about an hour. We're gonna see how long it lasts. I'm using it right here. Let me show you. Actually, I'm just gonna cover it. If I take the light away, you see how I'm just using it as like an accent light. I'm using the lights of the room as my main light. It's not the ideal, but if you're wanting to just do a quality video for a really low budget, it is a really good way to go. Some of you might hit me up in the comments and ask me why I didn't buy the ring light that came with the stand and the uh, iPhone clip or the phone clip. And there's a couple of reasons for it. The first one being that phone clip sits on an accordion. And so it pulled the weight of, I have a heavy phone. I have a iPhone 12 Pro Max and that pulls down on that accordion really bad. And you end up having a bouncy phone that's not sturdy and not sitting right. And uh, the other reason, and the really biggest important reason is I already own two of them. My wife would kill me if I brought home a third. They are good lights. They're very, here, let me show you how good the lights are. Like if you wanted to, for this to just be your light, you would not go wrong with this. Like you could set this here and you get that great ring light look, right? But I wanted to go with something different and maybe you didn't have the extra $10 for the ring light. You only had $5 to buy a light. This light is really good. Like I said, it's ambient light. So it's not bad. Um, I did go for the USB microphone. I'm not really like, I'm not optimistic. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like I'm really not optimistic about this microphone. For one, it's only $10. It's made of plastic, so 
this pop filter tends to move around a lot and there's just I don't know just something about it well I, there's just one way to find out we're gonna plug it in and we're gonna let's see what it sounds like I could be so wrong they did have another microphone that was five dollars again I've already bought that it's not a bad microphone comes with its own little stand pretty sturdy pretty solid the audio isn't great it is plastic and so it doesn't pick up your voice as well as I would like so I haven't really used that one I will use it if I'm doing something where I want to hold the microphone very close to my mouth but otherwise I'm gonna use my lavalier mic like I am now or I'll use my heyday microphone I got from Target but since we're here we have this guy hooked up let's go ahead and give it a listen and see what it sounds like okay so here is whoa this is a ten dollar microphone are you insane i love this thing this is ten dollars oh man if this sounds as good when oh can i hear this <laughs> sorry there was a delay in my headphones if this sounds this good when i record when i go to edit this color me shooketh like i don't know what else to say like that is phenomenal oh, i am so excited about this all right i need to go ahead and record this video it's late um watch the video guys if you haven't already let me know it's going to be on color grading inside lumafusion versus final cut let me know guys how you feel about it let me know in the comments if this was a good video if this is a good buy if you're gonna be using it if you use it guys let me know how it works for you see if you have the same experience that i do like i said i got all of this at five below my total price including this white poster board that i ended up not using i was going to use it as a bounce card it helps a lot but it's a lot of setup so I, I may set it here as a bounce card i don't know but it's here i can use this for other things so it's not a bad deal but everything together i spent 25 dollars, and that's not bad that's one trip to mcdonald's basically if you're going for more than just yourself so definitely worth a couple of dollars to invest in yourself and to get a really good high quality sound really good high quality image and a good decent amount of lighting and you can put a really stellar looking youtube video up with only 25 dollars that is pretty amazing and i think that deserves a like i think that deserves a subscription i definitely think that deserves for you to help me get this on the algorithm for others to see it until next time guys stay safe stay healthy god bless and keep editing i hope you have a great week now i don't want to use this LUT here just because for two well for two reasons one it doesn't look as good in final cut as it does in lumafusion like i said it comes built into lumafusion with final cut 